legendary Virginia coach Roy Hill. Coach Hill, huge week for you. You hear it, Coach Jordan? First off, first things first, why you guys come all the way from uh, Georgia or Virginia to Ohio? What, what's so good about Jeff Jordan State Champions? Well, uh, you know, I, I, this is our second time out here. We came out here about four years ago. And, uh, you know, when you talk to people in wrestling, you ask them where's the best place to go to get your kids trained, to get their mindset ready, uh, this is the place to go. So uh, we've been trying to get in here, back in here, and we finally got on the list this year, so we came. You know, Eight-hour drive, but it's worth it. Okay, so you got how many guys here? We got ten. Ten here? guys here, yeah. Okay. You guys uh, had an interesting thing happen to you this year with the uh, – you guys split schools four years ago, right? Yeah, they split our school four years ago, and uh, we won our district uh, every year since 2000, essentially. And so for the first time this year, we didn't win our district. We came in second, and uh, the team we lost to was the team that's split off from our school. And uh, it made it a little tough to lose to kids that were freshmen in, your, in our program four years ago. But, you know, we're ready to move on. All right, you have a huge week planned. You're here at Jeff Jordan's. Where do you have to go tonight? Uh, fly out of here tonight to go up to Minneapolis. Uh, tomorrow I have to give a presentation to the National High School Coaches Athletic Association. Um, uh, doing a presentation on peaking. And then later tomorrow night they have a uh, National Coaches, uh, Coach of the Year award. And I was selected as one of the eight finalists for that. So. Uh, that's a really big deal. My father's flying out from California, so this, this should be a fun, fun night. Okay, then from there, where are you going? It's like I said, it's a crazy week. Where are you going from Minnesota? Then uh, the next morning, I fly out to Oklahoma for Oklahoma City for the Junior National Duels. Uh, our guys head out; they headed out there yesterday, so they'll start the Greco tournament tomorrow. So I'll miss a day or so of the Greco, and we'll get out there for the rest of the tournament. Okay, what's your role in Fargo? What do you do with uh, Team Virginia and the freestyle and Greco Roman, the cadets and the and the uh, juniors? Well, I've uh, I'm elected as the uh, Virginia Wrestling Association uh, chairman, which is with the uh, wing of USA Wrestling in Virginia, and so uh, in that role, I have to do a lot of the planning for Fargo, uh, our training camps, all our national teams. We have uh, schoolboy team cadet team and junior team going out to the various dual team nationals and of course the big granddaddy at all is the event out in Fargo, North Dakota. So you're a busy man all the time. Yeah, summer's very short <laughs> and, you know a week or so after Fargo football starts up so uh, what, would, stop. what would you tell people about the state of wrestling the state of Virginia and the state of wrestling in Virginia? Well we're very excited about uh, wrestling in Virginia. Uh, Two or three years ago, a lot of the universities made a big commitment in Virginia to the wrestling program. Uh, UVA brought in an excellent coach, and they're doing a good, good thing. They've had great recruiting years. Old Dominion uh, reached into the high school ranks to pull in Stevie Martin, and they're on the cusp of breaking to the top ten next year. And Virginia Tech uh, brought Kevin Dresser up from the high school ranks, and right away he's had a huge impact. So. Uh, we're looking to have three programs in our state, possibly in the top 10 or top 15 next year. Uh, in addition, we have uh, old uh, George Mason University who's doing some things as well. Uh, VMI is a fifth uh, Division One school in the state of Virginia, so we're very fortunate in that regard. Liberty as well? And, excuse me, six Liberty, that's right. And uh, Liberty's uh, done a very good job in the eastern region, bringing six, eight kids out to the nationals every year. So. Uh, for a state our size, we're very fortunate to have that many quality programs. All right, Coach, you got anything else out there for the people in Virginia or across the country that you want people to know about what you're doing and what's going on with Virginia? Well, just uh, just keep an eye on on the state. Uh, you know, Virginia's known for lovers, but pretty soon we'll be known for wrestling too. <laughs> Thanks, Coach. Hill. All right.